I know you all are finding homeschooling really hard because who isn't? I mean, you got to try and do everything by yourself, but do not worry because you guys know that I am here to help you as much as I can. And one of the things that I'm helping you with today is introducing you to my new favorite thing, which is the Oxford Revise app to help you remember everything that you need to for science and maths. Now, this remembering is really, really important because recall of basic facts is a big, big chunk of your exams. And if you don't have or externally set assessments or whatever they're going to call them this year, and if you don't have the basic facts ready in your head to be able to retrieve them really, really quickly, then you're going to struggle to do all the other bits like the analysis and the evaluation and the application. So retrieval practice using multiple choice questions to quickly go over facts and get them sorted and secured in your brain is a really, really good good, brilliant, important things to do. Now, you guys know that I love these because I have done loads of these in the Oxford Revised books for you. And then because the people at Oxford are lovely and brilliant to go with the books, they've come up with this web app. And that is what we are going to be looking at today. I will put a link to this down in the description. But as you can see over here, it is absolutely brilliant. It's going to be really, really helpful for you taking the stress out of studying, taking the stress of working out what you need to do when, because Oxford are doing it all for you. Now these go brilliantly with the print versions of the books and you can see that they've got the courses all sorted out into the different units so that you can go through and master exactly what is going on before you move on to the next thing. You can keep your knowledge fresh by going over and over different things and then you can push that knowledge into the long-term memory where you can have it ready to recall during the exams. You can try this all for free and you can see that they've got the courses sorted out into combined science, into the separate science for AQA and then for higher and foundation for maths as well. So I've been using this and obviously I think should know my science so i'm just going to take you through what it is, looks like on the inside so you can see all of the courses that they've got and i'm just going to try a biology quiz to show you what it's like now you can try all of this for free before you sign up for anything so i'm going to try the first quiz now i'm going to deliberately get some of these wrong i promise it's deliberate so you can see what it's like it's timed you get 60 seconds to try each thing out and you can like you know work it out and um, try and figure it out if you get it wrong it tells you what the right answer is so you've got time to write that down before you move on to the next question however there is big celebrations if you get something right now as you're going through getting things right getting things wrong you can be using this time before you move on to the next question to make notes and to write things down in your um in your notes to make sure that you've got them there so any things that you do get wrong you can correct yourself um and write it down somewhere and then hopefully next time you'll get it right because you can do these as many times as you want to there were 20 questions in this quiz and I got the last one right. Yay, well done me. Now, I did not get all of these right because I was showing you what it's like. So it's given me two stars for this, which means I can't go on to the next quiz yet. You can only go on to the next quiz when you get three stars for something. So we're going to go and um, back to the course to have a look and we can see that the next one, cell transport, is still locked. So to be able to get on to doing cell transport, I have to retake the quiz and hopefully this time get three stars. So thankfully, yes, I did manage to get three stars, which means I can now go um, save and finish, go back to the course and we can see that the next one has opened up. So it's not letting you like rush too far ahead. It's really, really focusing on the master 
mastery of this knowledge, ensuring that you have the knowledge secure in your head before you rush off and do something else. Now you can see for biology there are loads and loads of quizzes on there for you. And you can, like, I'm doing this on my phone, you can just sit there while you're waiting for something to happen, um, doing lots of different things. You can just try this wherever you are. You can see the physics course has lots of quizzes on it as well. And one of the things that I love is right at the bottom, they've got these really nice kind of like synoptic quizzes that you can do just before you go into like a test or an exam to see how you are. The, the courses page shows you how far you are through each things. The maths one is brilliant because there are time limits on how long you spend on each question to ensure that you're not mm, being too slow because in the exam we do have to work at roughly one mark per minute. So this is a new web app that I absolutely love. Um, it goes really really well with the books that I've written and I know that sounds like I'm completely biased but it is true um, and it's one of the many many things that I would strongly be encouraging you to use as part of your homeschooling. Um, good luck guys, do not forget I'm going to be here with you every single step of the way.